Welcome back to the Johnny Johnny Show. Oh, hi. Welcome back to the Johnny Johnny Show. <laughs> Welcome back to the Johnny Johnny Show. Oh, hi. I don't think we formally met. I'm Johnny Johnny. Hello, my name is John Alfaro, and I am the star of the Johnny Johnny Show, which is a show that you don't know about. The Johnny Johnny Show is a show that me and my buddies created back when we were in high school. It just consisted of me running around doing some stupid stuff, as well as my buddy being the cameraman, as well as guest appearances from my other friends. Help! My baby! <laughs> it's okay, I'll save you. Thank you, sir. Oh, oh, help! I'm trying! I'm trying! I'm trying! One day, my buddy just grabbed a camera and we said, hey, let's go film some stupid stuff. And sure enough, what we did is we filmed our shenanigans outside in a nearby park. We titled it The Johnny Johnny Show and I played a character named Johnny Johnny, who is a uh, not so PC character. My favorite thing about The Johnny Johnny Show was going outside every single week, grabbing a camera and not even having a script. We didn't have a budget. We didn't have any sort of technical, weird, expensive equipment we just grabbed the cheapest camera we could find and we filmed it and it was pretty fun because you know we made a compilation of all the adventures we had outdoors my favorite character of the johnny johnny show was johnny johnny obviously because he had no regards for other people's feelings or anything else in the world so whatever he did he did because he wanted to and he just did it regardless of people's feelings another one of my favorite characters who isn't me is one of my friends who played an Asian monk and he started in a couple episodes and that was very fun because sometimes the Johnny Johnny show was just me being myself and it was just only me in the episode but for episodes where it was me and the Asian monk character it was more interaction with Johnny Johnny and more interaction with other characters. My favorite episode would have to be the one where me and the Asian monk gets get trapped in a in a trail Usually we try filming these at trails and parks, but they're all nearby. We went to a trail that we haven't explored very much, and the joy about filming there is that while we were filming, we didn't know what to expect since we didn't know the trail very well at, at the scene. If there is one thing that I'd like to improve on the Johnny Johnny show, I'd like to have more adventures. <laughs> The original show was was unscripted, so whatever we filmed at the park, that's basically what it was. I'm not saying I'd like to have a script for it, because that's kind of what gave the show its charm, is that it was just unpredictable in that sense, but I'd say more locations to film at, and more, more characters to be seen in the Johnny Johnny show. I would like to have a reboot of the Johnny Johnny show, but obviously there's going to have to be some things that would have to be changed. For example, a lot of the jokes would have to be toned down because not only if I were to make a reboot, not only would my friends watch it, but also I'd like to publish it publicly. And also I'd like to have like a general story, not necessarily a script, but a story where we can see Johnny Johnny develop as a character as opposed to just him doing random things and not knowing anything about him. The Johnny Johnny show ended because we were 14, 15, and 16 when we made it. So throughout those years we were very young, immature kids, and we thought it was funny. And yeah, there are still some aspects that are funny to it, but you know, things change, the times change, and now there's no real need to have a Johnny Johnny show. We're all grown up now, and it's kind of sad to say that that chapter of our life is going to be out where we're not making dumb, dumb videos all the time. But at the same time, like I said, there's no real need because we're grown up now. It's time for me to have my Thanksgiving feast.